Hi, my name is Kyler Key. I'm in your Humanities 300 class. Um, I'm at the Crocker Art Museum right now with um, one of the other kids in this class. Um, while looking through the whole museum, um, a lot of different things stood out to me. And at first I wanted to do something on the statue. Um, and I saw a lot of different statues, but when we got to this part of the museum, this is what really stood out to me. Um, it's a um, the how do I explain it? It's a mixed media by Peter Combe. Um, it's like this. Um, when you look closely at it, it's an art piece with a lot of paint switches. Um, yeah, the painting's called Dick, and I'll do more um, description outside of the museum just because it's a little crowded in here. Hi, I just got home from the museum. I told you I was gonna finish my video up a little bit later just because it was a little crowded in the museum, so I didn't wanna be too loud. Um, the reason that um, painting stood out to me was because at first, I thought it was just some normal painting and then I looked closely and it was a bunch of paint switches, which was really interesting to me. I've never really seen anything to that extent or really seen a um, art piece done with paint switches, which um really intrigued me so that was the reason why i picked that um i would recommend the crocker art museum um just for the normal person to go i think it was very interesting there's a lot of things there's a lot of different cultural cultural aspects of the museum that i thought were very interesting i love the exhibit on california um i almost did a piece on there but then i decided not to just because i found that picture um, the only thing that really turned me off about it was the security was a little iffy to me. Um, it seemed like they didn't like having younger um, kids in there, um, even though we're in college. I, it doesn't seem like they like the younger crowd. But other than that, I think it was a really good experience.